Hello, this is Jeff at Obedia here to give you another video covering bouncing your song to an audio file and mixing down your song into one complete track or two channel stereo audio file or however you like to describe it. So what we're going to do is take this pretty mix that I've done and then we're going to export it as an audio file. The first thing we need to do is establish our start and end markers. So we need to go over to our flag, which is our marker track. As you see, the start marker is usually going to start at the beginning. If you did not set the appropriate time frame when you created the song, you will need to grab your end marker, which is probably somewhere out. If you zoom out of your sequencer, it's somewhere out in right field. Just grab the marker and bring it to the end of your track. You may need to zoom in to fine tune it. If your track is on a bar and a beat, just snap it to the nearest bar. Once you do this, go to the top, click on song, export mix down. The first three dots, if you've seen it before, is the function to show where you want to save your track. The next is the file name. So you'll give your track a name. Publishing, this occurs if you want to send your mix to Notion or directly link your Studio One to SoundCloud and upload it directly to SoundCloud without having to access the internet browser and upload it by SoundCloud's website. Your format is your list of audio files you can export it to. Note if you're using Artist or Prime, you may not have all of these options. Studio One does give the ability to add these options as an add-on if you do not have it. Your resolution and sample rate should generally stay the same as your project file. Therefore, if you record it at 24-bit 44.1, you should usually keep your master file at this resolution. The next thing is the export range. Now, originally we set our start and our end markers. So we want to choose between song start and end marker. If you don't, you can loop the section that you want to export. In order to loop, you'll want to take your mouse and highlight this bar at the top where it creates a pencil mark. This will set a loop. If you don't, you can also export between each marker. So if you have different markers set, for example, a marker for guitar insert here, a next one for drum start playing, you can export different sections of your song between each marker. If you don't want to do that, you can also select between what marker you will want to export your song. Normally, you'll want to export between a song start and end marker. Unless you're working with multiple outputs, your output should normally be main or one and two or whatever the default output that is set with their interface. Bypass master effects will disregard any effects that you put on the master channel. Using real time processing means that it will export your track in real time. Real time means that it will export your song as it is running. Therefore, you will sit through the entire duration of your track as it's exporting. Write tempo to audio files means that the tempo associated with your session, this information will be embedded into your audio file. Import to track means that once it's done exporting, it will then put the mix down back into your session. This is good for referencing earlier mixes as you constantly update your mix over time. Close out the export simply means that once the export is finished, this dialog box will close. And that's all there is to it. So once you export the file, you will see it pop up inside of your browser and then you can take it away and upload it to SoundCloud, Spotify, get it on an album, do whatever you need to do. At that point, it is a finished stereo file, two track, draft, or whatever it's made for. So that was covering mixing down your song into an audio file. Today's pro audio hardware and software can give you excellent results if you know how to use it properly. Obedia can help you to get the most out of your pro audio hardware and software. 
Why spend your time scouring the internet for answers or digging through manuals? With one quick call to an Obedia technician, you'll be connected with someone who can give you the answers that you need in real time via phone and remote desktop. Obedia technicians are trained in all major digital audio applications on Mac, PC, iOS, and Android devices. Obedia member subscriptions are cost effective, give you great member benefits, and Obedia is here seven days a week to help you get the most out of your digital audio hardware and software. No matter what your level of expertise, Obedia can help you to stay focused and productive and get your music back on track. Start taming your technology today with Obedia.